but but we never really allow space for the stories of Palestinians seek, seeking safety and sanctuary to be uplifted. And to me, it is the, the, the dehumanization and the silencing of a particular pain and suffering of people should not be okay and normal. And you can't be in the practice of humanizing and uplifting the suffering of one if you're not willing to do that for everyone. And so, so for me, I know that when I hear, right, my, my, my Jewish constituents or or friends or you know colleagues speak about Palestinians who don't want safety or Palestinians who aren't deserving, I stay focused on that the, the actual debate about what that process should look like. I never go in the dark place of saying, here's a Jewish person, they're talking about Palestinians, Palestinians are Muslim, maybe they're Islamophobic. I never allow myself to go there because I don't have, I don't have to. And what I am fearful of is that because Rashida and I are Muslim, that a lot of our Jewish colleagues, a lot of our constituents, a lot of our allies go to thinking that everything we say about Israel to, to be an anti-Semitic because we are Muslim. And so to me, it is, it, it's, it's something that becomes designed to end the debate. Because you get in this space of, yes, right? Like, I know what intolerance looks like, and I'm sensitive when someone says the words you use, Ilhan, are resemblance of intolerance. And I am cautious of that, and I feel pained by that. But it, but, it, it almost as if every single time we say something, regardless of what it is we say, that is supposed to be about foreign policy, our engagement, our advocacy about ending oppression, or the freeing of every human life and, and wanting dignity, we get to be labeled in something and that ends the discussion because we end up defending that and nobody ever gets to have the broader debate of what is happening with Palestine. So for me, I want to talk about, I want to talk about the political influence in this country that says it is okay for people to push for allegiance to a foreign country. I want to ask, why is it okay for me to talk about the influence of the NRA, of fossil fuel industries, or big pharma, and not talk about a powerful lobbying group that is influencing policy. I want to ask the question, I want to ask the question of why is it okay for you to push 